What are we about to do today? Well, we're going to test out physical launch at level 10 links on every single one of her categories. Granted, that's not too many categories, but hopefully it'll give you a good idea of what she's capable of. Now, my launch only has one dupe, but I've invested in additional attacks since we'll have three chances for that 28% to roll. No equips have been used just to keep it as a nice baseline. And if you want to see a different unit showcased, let me know on Twitter or in the comments down below. Let's do it. All right, so for DB Saga, we're including youth units because Int Kid Goku is going to lead both of those, and that'll let us bring Tech Blue up for support. If you want to go full DB Saga, you're definitely going to be a little bit more limited. Uh, launch's linking partner here is Physical Kid Chi Chi, since that's going to activate most of her important links. The other slots on the team don't matter for the showcase, so we just threw in LR Gohans. So while the plan here was to link with Physical Kid Chi Chi, we actually ended up linking Kid Goku and Bula, and that actually works out just fine, because Kid Goku is going to link up with all the uh, DB Saga links. And then Bula's got the relevant Battlefield Diva and all that. So we ended up with the exact same link setup. That's 32% attack. Of course, Bula's got the 40% support and the leader skill is 170%. So we end up seeing Launch hit 1.5 million on each of her attacks. And the cool thing about Launch is that she's not going to fluctuate much with her attack stat here because her, her super attack isn't going to be raising her attack or anything like that. There's no attack stacks. So it's always going to be pretty stable for those first six turns. So as long as we have this rotation going, she is going to constantly hit 1.5 million. And again, she does have that 50% quick chance. Now, Transformation Boost is going to focus a lot more on support. While it's a better category, there really isn't a way for us to activate most of Launch's links. So the sad thing about Transformation Boost is that we don't actually have a good linking partner for Launch. There's no one that's going to really be able to activate her DB Saga links like the Incredible Adventure or Guidance of the Dragon Balls. So she misses out on a lot of attack links there. Uh, we are going to link her with the Int Ribrian to activate the Peppy Gals links like Battlefield Diva and Metamorphosis for the transformation. Uh, and that's going to be nice, but unfortunately, again, we're missing out on those attack links. We do get 80% support from having Ribrian and Kid Buu since they're both going to be supports here. And you can see we were hitting about 1.4 million uh, attack. And again, we hit three times with one normal attack. Unfortunately for Peppy Gals, I wasn't able to pull STR Videl. I did try, but unfortunately no luck. So we're going to go with a physical launch lead to save some space since both her and Interibrian are 120% leaders. And we'll also be grabbing a friend lead Videl. Now with Peppy Gals, we've got kind of the ideal situation here. We've got her linked with Chi Chi, so she gets all the DB Saga and the Battlefield Diva stuff. Uh, so she's up to 32% attack from Lynx. And then she also gets 40% support from Bula. Unfortunately, because we are running it under the launch leader skill, it is going to be a little bit lower. If we were running it on Videl, you'd see something a little closer to the DB Saga uh, 1.5 million we were getting. But here, it's going to be about 1.3 million. Earthlings is a weird category, and there is one possibility for support, but unfortunately, I never pulled him either. The new tech Krillin from the general pool would be good to throw on this team. Either way, this is definitely one of her more gimmicky categories. So the sad thing about Earthlings is it's not going to really be her best category. She's got no real support except for the tech Krillin, which again, we don't have. Uh, she's at least going to link with the physical Chi Chi, which is nice. It activates most of her links, but... Uh, having the like 150% attack leader skill is going to be kind of an issue as well as just the category in general. It doesn't really matter what's going to be in the floating spot, but like there's not very much for you to really choose from when you're building this team. So ultimately like launch is going to struggle a bit here. You can see she's hitting 1.2 million, which isn't the biggest drop compared to all the other ones, but honestly, she could do better. And that was physical launch on all of her categories. You guys voted for her to be the next unit we showcase on Twitter, and around the time this video goes live, I should have a tweet up where you can suggest the next one we do out of all my max linked units. I'll also have another video up this week going over how I feel about launch as a unit, you know, how good she is, what category her best team is, and you know, so on. So if you don't want to miss that, make sure to subscribe and maybe hit the bell if you want. Uh, surprisingly, a good portion of you guys actually already have, so you know, I really appreciate that. But anyway, I hope you all have a good day a good week, a good life, and happy summons. Goodbye.